New at 10, nothing to cheer about for a mother in Pennsylvania who is facing several charges tonight. She is accused of creating what's called deep fake videos. That's when pictures or video is manipulated to make it appear like it's someone else. The mother allegedly created these fake images and harassed her daughter's rival teammates on the cheerleading squad. Here's Lauren Dugan. This mugshot of Rafaela Spohn is very real. The reason behind her criminal charges, investigators say, centers around creating fake photos and videos of her daughter's cheerleading teammates that could have gotten them kicked off the team. It would devastate me. The 50-year-old cheer mom is accused of harassing three of her daughter's teammates, all minors at the time, and members of the Victory Vipers in Doylestown. Authorities say starting last summer, Spohn created fake videos where the girls appear to be vaping and drinking, plus photos where the girls appear to be Naked. She manipulated them. Spone also allegedly sent voicemails telling one girl to kill herself. Law enforcement says they seized Spone's phone and found the manipulated media. We take it as gospel that a picture is a picture, a video is a video, that they're unaltered, untainted. This is a setback. Spone faces criminal charges for three counts of cyber harassment and three counts of harassment. She's not guilty and she's innocent until proven guilty. Because of this, she has herself received very severe death threats and along with her daughter. The Victory Vipers sent a statement to Fox 29 saying they have a very strict anti-bullying policy and all athletes involved are no longer in the program. Now the DA urges parents to be on their guard for this new kind of manipulating technology called deep fakes. Frankly, it's pretty difficult to protect from somebody that wants to alter uh, an image that's put out there on social media, but we have to be very vigilant and make sure that our children are being protected constantly. The father of one of the alleged victims believes the harassment began when he told his daughter to stop hanging out with Spone's daughter. There is no indication Spone's daughter knew of her mom's alleged actions.